time to meet the pro middleweight fighters. First, fighting out of the knockouts, here comes from in the red corner. In the black chunks out of the knockouts, haircuts for men, red corner, we have Ian Heinisch. He represents Factory X facing off against the fighter out of the Genesis Mechanical corner. We have Mr. Dante Flores wearing the black and red trunks representing Trials MMA. Ron, for the second time tonight on the fight card, undefeated fighters in the cage. Both these guys, 6 and 0. Oh, and missing with the punch and slipping was Heinisch. But as we've seen him do time and time again, puts his wrestling prowess on display and takes top position. Ian Heinisch is an absolute beast in Colorado or anywhere. Make no mistake about it. He's, he's the kind of guy that's literally steamrolled opponents so far. Dante Flores is absolutely a tougher test. There's no question about it. But Ian Heinisch right now is on a meteoric rise. Good knee off the bottom by Flores. That's a technique you don't see often enough. Coming out of the trials camp, you'd expect those guys to be coming up with great technique. As you talked about earlier, UFC fighter Ed Herman, coach over there. Also former IFL fighter Ryan Schultz, coach over there. And still working from the top here is Heinisch. He was trying to pass guard. Flores did a good job stuffing the knee, not letting it come through. But Heinisch, heavy top pressure, looking to get a little distance and skip some elbows down here. You know, a little and bit. There it is. A little bit of uh, inexperience showing right there by Ian Heinisch, just because he's he's got that side choke available to him. However, he can make up for it by making things happen, and he's doing it right now again. Heavy hips being shown by Heinisch. Flores continues to try to work from the bottom, not throwing up any submission attempts, just trying to make sure that he doesn't get in too bad of a position. And Heinisch looking to wrap up the far arm now. Oh Flores with a pained look on his face, like almost maybe he has an injury or something because Heinisch wasn't wrapping that arm or twisting the shoulder or anything yet. I saw that Or it too. could just be a lot of hard work off the bottom by Flores. Probably Trying a little bit of Heinisch, <laughs> yeah. Heinisch momentary, momentarily rather, had a little bit of distance there, tried to get a strike in. Good job off of his back by Flores with the defense, has full guard recovered. <laughs> Flores looking to trap the elbow as well, but Heinisch doing a nice job of posturing up and delivering some left hands. Three five-minute rounds here in the professional division. If a fighter is standing, you can knee to the head and the face. And those are the rule differences here. And Flores active with the guard, trying to wrap something up. Heinisch has seen that in camp. Shucks him down, tries to turn the corner. But again, good guard work by Flores, able to trap at least one leg and maintain half. Guard off the bottom. And we've got a timeout here. Not sure what happened. Going to see if I can hear what the referee says. It was the back of the head strike is what it was. So it's referee's discretion as to whether or not he wants to take a point. He's not going to. It's just a warning. But what does happen for Heinisch doing that illegal move is he loses position. And a big overhand right lands for Heinisch. Referee's taking a close look at it. Flores trying to recover, but the flurry by Heinisch lets him retain his undefeated record and backflips his way to 7 0 to the Factory X fighter, Ian Heinisch. Unbelievable. This kid is a monster. This kid is a monster. I'm really going to find it difficult for people to take fights against him moving forward 
I don't. Th I think that that fight was stopped a little early myself. But uh, I can tell you this: that Ian Heinish is uh, is really something special. Factory X fight team out of uh, Inglewood, Colorado is literally on a tear. These guys are literally on a tear. We're going to kick it back up to Butch for the initial official announcement. At 306 of round number one, referee Pius has come a step to this fight and declaring the winner by two Thank you. 